this is my channel so welcome welcome back to my channel just kidding this is joyful trails and um you're probably expecting my uncle scott but he's just not here right now anyways and so i'm his niece and i'm gonna be talking to you about today's trail so today on joyful trails we are in greenville south carolina and we are on the swan lake trail in at Furman University. So now let's take a look at Furman. Let's go. So did you start the video? Yeah. You did? Okay. Yeah. Uh, did you explain that you're my niece? Right? Yeah. Okay. So welcome back to Joyful Trails, and did you tell them we're at Furman? Yeah. Furman University. Furman. I just said that we were at this, the Swan Lake Trail at Furman University. Okay. Yes. We are at Furman Woke Indoctrination Center. I mean, University. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Did that you know, could be a blooper. I, hey, I brought some notes so that we could um, tell people more about Furman. It is South Carolina's oldest private college. I mean, that's pretty wild, you know what? It looks pretty new to me. <laughs> it does look new, but um, it's the oldest private college. And it, it used to be a Christian college, but that it's changed. not It's not anymore. It's very sad. But, but the good part, yes you can. The good part is that they still allow Christians to come and ride bikes here. So that's good. Who wouldn't? <laughs> they, you know they, what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tell you guys another fact. Okay. Furman was named one of the 362 most beautiful places in Amer in America by the American Society of Landscape Archite Architects. I can't talk. Great. <laughs> so it's a seven hundred and fifty acre wooded campus that's big that's a lot 750 acres is a lot i mean to be honest if you just look in the back you can see it's pretty beautiful and to have a trail around here is kind of cool too yes well enough about Furman. we got a trail to ride let's the swamp flaked three two one well and uh, but enough about Furman, we got a trail to ride. The Swan Lake Trail, let's go. I woke up feeling on top of the world Like nothing's ever gonna bring me down This feeling got me flying high as a bird I may never touch the ground It may not be my birthday But I just wanna celebrate
So Destiny, we're gonna talk about this trail, but first let me just ask you, and I'm serious now, as a 10 year old, you're 10, right? Yes. As a 10 year old girl, what do you enjoy about riding bikes? Well, to be honest, it, it's it's a good exercise, but at the same time, it's just it's just kind of fun to be able to like, most of the time if it's like a trail like this or something, then like most people are walking and then you get to just like zoom past them. And it's, it's kind of fun to go down hills and it's not fun to go up the hill, but it's fun to go down. What are your thoughts on helmets, bike helmets? Because, you know, well, you're, you have one on now. I wore one today on the trail, right but I don't, yeah, I don't always wear a helmet, and but you normally do. So what, what are your thoughts on helmets? I have to wear one because my dad wants me to wear them for my safety. But to be honest, I don't think I'm going to fall off of a bike and hit my head and break it and then have to go to the hospital and potentially die. All right. Yeah, see, I'm. this is a big debate that people have online, um, especially like on YouTube and Facebook and all that kind of stuff where they argue about it a lot. Um, the thing is, I usually only ride on flat, paved trails. And so, like yeah, the chance of me falling, like you said, the chance of me falling off and landing it's, on my head it's is... It's about a 20% chance that I'm going to fall off and break my head. Probably even a lot, a lot less than 20%. But anyway, um, you know, if people want to wear them, then I think they should. That's great. Well, I don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with wearing them. I just don't think there's a need to have to wear them if it's like a flat trail. I mean, like if it's some big old bumpy thing that's not paved and it's just like got all these broken spots in the road and in like this yeah there's snow yeah and a bunch of like potholes and whatnot yeah. we'll continue this conversation later but let's talk about this trail the swan lake trail is a 1.8 mile loop around the university's 40 acre spring fit spring fed lake with its stunning view of paris mountain dedicated all the way back in 1965 when I was three years old. Wow, you're just that old? <laughs> the bell tower features 60 bells that were cast in Holland and it was built to the same specifications as the original Furman bell tower that used to be in downtown Greenville, South Carolina. As you make your way around this lake, you come across a number of other points of interest, including some old historic buildings, a rose garden, and much more. And Destiny, I know that you get excited about the wildlife. What are some of the animals or whatever that you saw today? Well, as the name permits, it has a swans, and yes. they're very pretty. One thing that freaks me out is they have red eyes, and it scares me. But anyways, there's ducks, and right now is duck season and like for them to have babies, and there's so many cute little babies around. And also, there's a bunch of turtles out here. Like they have a lot of turtles in here. See, there's one sticking its head up out there. See it? Yep. Yeah, there's a lot of turtles over here. Then they have like, a, there's, the bri there's a bridge, and then on the other side, it's kind of a little bit swampy, a little bit. And that's where a lot of the hangers, like uh, a lot of the, turtles like to hang out. So they basically have a pretty good area and they don't get bothered unless they're being fed. And the ducks get fed and the swans get fed. So yeah. And you know, the people are really nice here. The people are all very nice and polite. And I, I noticed that when you would say on your left, when you would go around people. They would th say thank you. They would say thank you and they appreciated that. And <laughs> On your left. Thank you. On your left. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> On your left. Thank you. You're welcome. You are very good at alerting us. We appreciate it. Thank you. And most of the people around here always are having a, they always have a big smile on their face. And a lot of the people are just very nice and they're, I haven't met one person that's had an attitude or has been like mad or something. Because I think this is pretty peaceful. We'll stop when we get down here to the bridge. 
Actually, let's go all the way to the little bridge that goes over the creek. And we'll stop there. So when we get back to the house in the in like an hour, then we can um get an ice cream out of the freezer. Yeah. And then after that, we could go to the pool. Well, I don't know about you, but I've been riding this trail for a little while and I think I'm hungry. Just for like a little snack. I think we should. And in fact, you chose this snack for us. It's the Lunchables. Lunchables Cookie Dunks, ladies and gentlemen. It's the snack combinations. So, let's see. It has mini chocolate chip cookies, marshmallow cream, and sprinkles. And I chose the same one as him. I've had all of them before. So I just want it because, and he apparently, surprisingly, has not tried them before. So I got the same one as him. <laughs> I've not had Lunchables cookie dunks snack before. Snack combination. Or any snack combinations. Shocker. <laughs> Most of mine just went on to the top <gasps> of the wrapper. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Look at that. Ah. <laughs> I highly recommend these. Highly recommend. So Destiny, you're the only guest that I've ever had on this YouTube channel so far. Mm -hmm. So you've done a great job. Appreciate it. But right now, this is a huge responsibility. I'm going to allow you to assign the star rating for this trail. I'm gonna let you decide how many stars we give the trail. I mean, that's what we do here at Joyful Trails. We, we explore, rate, and review bike trails and hopefully find a little joy in the journey, right? So I'm gonna allow you to decide on the star rating. I'm gonna give it a four and a half. Wow, well, due to graphics limitations, I, don't, I can't do halves, I wish I could. So we're gonna give it four stars, wow. That's amazing, good job. We're gonna give it a four. Cause it's not a very long trail, but it's a really nice trail. And one last thing, that bell tower is a little annoying when it wants to talk a lot. This is called Swan Lake Trail. Can you remember that? And Swan Lake Trail. Yeah. Just say that. I'll let them remind me. Just... <laughs> 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 